Hey guys, what up? It's your girl. Ow, what's on my toe? It's your girl's Yensid Nerd, and that hurt. Um, ow. Mmm. Ow. Not even your typical toe stuff. Okay. Oh, bringing this back in. Toe hurt. Um, I'm your girl Yensid Nerd who is having trouble focusing. What we're going to talk about today is not my stubbed toe, but getting healthy. Uh, a lot of my favorite YouTubers have been talking about trying to eat healthier and keeping their promises to eat healthier for us, the fans. And since I started doing YouTube ugh, five plus months ago, I have realized that I need to get into shape as well. And now with the fact I'm going to no filter, I now have a small goal which will keep me working out for at least 30 days and will hopefully create a habit. But some people are like, isn't getting healthy expensive? To which I say, no, and let me prove it to you. For instance, workout equipment. Where do you get workout equipment? A lot of people are like, well, you go to a local sports store. Wait, mm -mm. let me stop you right there. Well, then you go to Walmart or some multi-purpose store that has an exercise department. Oh, no. Let me stop you there again. Let's try one more time. Garage sale. Thrift shop. Repeat those after me. Garage sale or thrift shop. That's right. Get your equipment at a garage sale or a thrift shop. Why? Because people have spent hundreds of dollars on these wonderful pieces of exercise equipment on the As Seen on TV, Home Shopping Network ads, and now they're ready to get rid of them because they realize they never used them because they weren't committed to their fitness or just decided that it looked cool, got it, and never really had any idea of committing to fitness. They just thought it was a good idea. Now it's yours for the low, low price of as much as 90% off. So get that ish. Um, also, people are like, well, what about snacks? What do, what do I eat? What do I drink? Get more fruits and veggies in your diet, which is no problem. What do you want to do? Dollar Tree. If you were in a state with a Dollar Tree, oh, angels are singing, people. Hear the orchestra, check the choir, all kinds of snacks. In fact, I went to the Dollar Tree today and I got myself some healthy-ish snacks to show, to show what you can get. Peanuts. Big old bag of peanuts. This is 11, contains 11 servings of peanuts. High protein and fiber. Very important you find things that are high fiber and high protein. Protein, your body has to burn it like crazy. And fiber helps it all go back out. Um, then I found cranberries, dried cranberries. What? Dried fruity snacks that aren't the high fructose corn syrup snacks? Duh. Numb. What else did I get? Hold on. Looking rummaging through the bag. Oh, wait. Do I see banana chips? Even if we didn't grow up healthy, we've heard of banana chips before, people. You know you have. So banana chips, no? What else did I get? Hold on. Um, I got papaya pineapple. Little dried fruitiness. Delicious, sweet, fruity, healthy. Maybe not as healthy as like the stuff that costs like four bucks a bag, but hey. And then I recommend you drink a lot of juice and a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton of water. Um, especially because you're supposed to drink like what fluid ounce for every pound of body weight. Um, <coughs> I <coughs> sadly weigh around <coughs> 200 pounds. So um, that means I'm supposed to drink <coughs> 200 fluid ounces a day. Um, so I got myself some mango flavored fruit juice from the dollar store. It contains four servings of eight fluid ounces each. So yummy fruit drinkiness. Um, so that is my life hack for being healthy and cheap. Thrift shops, garage sales, dollar stores. These are your friends people. You can be healthy and not have to pay a ton of money. Being healthy doesn't mean you have to be broke. And being broke means you does not mean you cannot be healthy. So this is my life hack on being healthy. <coughs> healthy and I'm gonna go take a multivitamin and get some sleep because evidently uh, my body's trying to not be healthy because that was that was an awful cough. I will talk to you guys later. I love you.
I'll see you on the flip side, and I am out.